Okay, so today we have Morrissey, The Truth About Ruth, and um, for Morrissey Friday, I guess. And this is another one from I Am Not a Dog on a Chain. And this title has just been in my head, The Truth About Ruth, and I'm thinking I should react to that finally because uh, some people have requested it. And again, it's just been rolling around in my brain. So let's get into it, talk about it after. Three minutes, 45 seconds. Uh, yeah, let's go. Another kind of, you know, more recent Morrissey track. So let's go. Sorry if you hear my dog snoring. I am a sleuth, I dig up the truth, I ferret the facts even when there are none. A silent child, an elegant youth, this led me to find the truth about Ruth. Ruth is John. Ruth is John We all do what we can Just to get along That's true The life you lead Straightforward and blind Everything happens According to plan But some people fight just to take root in a world ill equipped for the truth about Ruth. Ruth is John. Ruth is John. Love that guitar. We all do what we can just to get along. Sounds like a fire at the end there. My God, a flame maybe. Okay, <clears throat> so Morrissey, the truth about Ruth. My gosh, that was worth the wait uh, <laughs> that I finally got to it finally here. Um, okay, so from the beginning when Morrissey comes in, it's almost like in a way he's not whispering, but his voice is, it's almost like he's telling you a secret. I mean, again, and you're talking about, I guess, the truth about Ruth. Uh, and I guess now that I think about it, I guess that's the point. You know, when you're telling somebody a secret, sometimes you're, you whisper to them or whatever, I guess. Um, you're kind of low-key about it. That's what he's doing here, it sounds like. He's kind of low-key when he first gets into it. Uh, when he talks about how he's a sleuth, you know, he digs for the truth and all this stuff. He's like, I'm not supposed to tell you this, but this is what I found. Uh, <laughs> it just, I don't know, like a detective or something. Anyway, and again, so bold and uh, bold and so bold and uh, just kind of uh in your face in a way where he's talking about these things and these hidden truths and i, I mean i would say we're talking about 
society here. Uh, we're talking about the pressures of society. We're talking about conformity, I guess you would say as well. And we're talking about uh, being yourself, identity. I mean, my God, the whole point of Ruth is John. And I, I mean, I feel like we're getting pretty deep here. Uh, I, I don't want to get too deep, I guess, just be, before I get into the lyrics. But yeah, just talking about all that stuff and identity challenges. And again, the uh, societal norms, whatever, and these challenges that uh, people face all the time uh, and trying to fit in. Uh, when again, fitting in is uh, not always, I guess, the, you know, the right thing to do or the best thing to do for, uh, you know, somebody, you know, to be yourself again. Um, you got to be yourself at all points, whatever. Um, yeah, so that all comes to mind. And again, uh, I want to talk about the instrumentation here, obviously. I love the uh, harmonium, I guess it was, uh, looking at looking at the uh, personnel here, uh, which again, is kind of, I guess you would say kind of an organ type thing, which was uh, Roger Manning was on harmonium here. And uh, I mean, my God, that was just so um, prevalent and relevant, whatever, prominent to there was a piano on the track as well from uh, uh, Gustavo Manzer. Uh, and I always, I don't know if I say his last name right or not, but either way, he was on, Gustavo was on piano on this one. Uh, and so dramatic. I mean, good Lord, dramatic as hell. Uh, almost haunting it away from the beginning uh, with that piano and that organ. organ. And uh, like I said, at one point, I love the guitar there. Almost like a Spanish flair in that guitar. I don't know if it was a, what kind of a guitar it was. Um, basically, in this, uh, uh, in this personnel, it does not, you know... Uh, cite any kind of uh, specific guitar other than there's a guitar and there's also electric guitar i think uh, on this track somewhere too but um again for this whole album here that i'm looking at the personnel from wikipedia there's so many different instruments and I'm just trying to see uh, all the instruments that are, apply to track nine, which is this track, The Truth About Ruth. But anyway, uh, like I was saying, just very dramatic, very um, haunting in a way too, and uh, almost operatic at the same time, you know, almost like an opera kind of voice was, you know, behind there, uh, which I don't know, it's just so... Uh, big and luxurious. I don't know. That's all the stuff that comes to my mind. And again, just kind of kept you on your toes. And, and then the way, you know, like I was saying, you have that organ and that piano just playing back and forth. And then the way that Morrissey comes into it, like I was saying, like a, like a sleuth, um, it's so interesting to listen to. <laughs> it's so kind of, uh, weird in a way i don't know it's just like it's like what's he talking about here my goodness and then we kind of find out uh with all these kind of societal things that he's talking about i guess you would say um so going through these two of these lyrics is that's what's really going on here i'm a sleuth i dig up the truth <laughs> again just you know right off the bat i mean what we're getting into here i dig up the truth i fear the facts even when there are none again it sounds like he's a detective of some kind a silent child an elegant youth this led me to find the truth about ruth and again i, I think about a, a child a silent child an elegant youth i think about the youth these children whatever because yeah, they don't know what the hell to think about the world yet i would say um and again you know how these people kind of might conform i don't know or they'll take the thoughts that their parents have whatever this kind of stuff leads me uh to that and uh you know what they'll think about the world one day is going to be uh because of their parents or again or what they learned in society uh, but again just when they're kids it's like they don't really have a an opinion on politics or i don't know anything like that it's just like uh again they're just kids and they're just having fun anyway it's just like where's their truth going to come from ruth is john ruth is john and again i can't think of anything else to say like who's ruth because again he's talking about earlier uh this led me to find the truth about ruth and i don't know if there's actually a ruth that morrissey's getting at here that he actually knows or whatever um i don't know uh, searching searching up the song i didn't see anything about a real ruth or whatever but either way ruth is john again i just think about confusion about uh you know making that confusion to talk about identity to talk about how ruth maybe turns into john when she's out and about you know when she's uh uh in front of people maybe you, you change who you are to try to get along with people as it goes on we all do what we can just to get along again it's just like you might not say what you actually think about something whatever the hell um just to get along with people and just to get the hell on through your life because again i mean my god i like people in short bursts most of the time as well um the life you lead you lead uh straightforward and bland and <laughs> i think i kind of laughed at that line because again it's just it's such a morrissey line um again just talking about how your life doesn't really have any other kind of plan it's always the same kind of thing um you don't kind of get out of your shell in a way you it's just a straightforward and bland life uh that you lead and it's just like and again morrissey i don't think i don't think he's being kind of rude about it it's just saying that's i mean that's just what happens to a lot of people anyway everything happens according to plan but some people 
uh, fight just to take root in a world ill-equipped for the truth about Ruth. My goodness, uh, for the truth about Ruth. Um, and again, just how these people who uh, don't live their life in a bland, straightforward way or according to plan, whatever the hell, uh, don't conform, I guess you might say too. Uh, life is a little bit different for these people. And, uh, you know, and the people who are, have these straightforward lives are ill-equipped, really, to uh, find out the truth about Ruth or to live life any other way. Then we have the course, once again, uh, that whole repetition of Ruth as John really is kind of interesting. And again, I just think about how he's talking about identity and all these things that come to mind. My God. Oh, bully for you. Oh, bully for you. <laughs> bully day. Um, your groin and your face. And I was like, what the hell is he talking about? Your groin and your face. They slip right into place. And I was like, is this getting sexual? Uh, so masoned and carved. Your arrow is drawn. And I like the way he's drawn because, of course, he has that accent, kind of like a drawn or whatever. Um, you know who you are, yet you have no idea. It's just like, oh, good Lord, that line. <laughs> that last line just really kind of hits you. Um, again, how, and I think about a song like XTC's uh, Making Plans for Nigel. Um, you know, completely kind of different songs, but in a way, talking about how Nigel has his parents. And not, you know, he didn't want them to, but his parents kind of mapped out life for Nigel, and Nigel has no choice but to follow it. Um, and in a way, how, you know, a lot, a lot of people have their life, you know, masoned and carved out, and it's just like, and then you think you know who you are, but at the same time, you have no idea who you are, because you've just been told what to do, or whatever the hell. I mean, yeah, again, it's just that whole concept is just so interesting to me. And then again, the chorus finishes it off here, Ruth is John, Ruth is John, and sooner or later... We are all calmed down. And I'm thinking about, is he talking about when you get older and you just kind of say, fuck it? You know, <laughs> I don't know. Um, or also when you just kind of stop fighting for the truth, whatever you might, whatever your truth is, you know, you just kind of stop going against the grain and you kind of just fall in and, you know, follow routine and, uh, you know, just say whatever, what, whatever, you know, I'm done. My rebellious days are over, whatever. I'm just going to conform now. I don't know. It's just, I don't know. This kind of stuff comes to my mind. And, uh, uh, yeah, so anyway, uh, very, very, uh, what's the word, intriguing, very captivating song here. I love the lyricism. Um, it really got me going, I guess. Uh, love the whole dramatic uh, feel to the song. Again, I have to mention uh, the organ, the piano, everyone on this track was great from, you know, again, Manzer, uh, from Jesse Tobias on guitar here. Um, and again, from uh, Roger Manning, of course, who was on uh, harmonium, like I said. And uh, just to piece this whole thing together. And of course, Morrissey had the lyrics here. And uh, yeah, and you know, convey such a uh, societal message, I guess you might say. Which again, this song fits in very well for, uh, you know, what Morrissey has been talking about these last few years, I guess you would say. So anyway, I guess that's all I gotta say. So thanks for watching. Thanks for liking, subscribing, commenting. How long is this video? Not too bad. Okay. So anyway, yeah, thanks for everything. Uh, thanks for the request too. Thanks for coming back for Morrissey Friday. Uh, so remember, yes, it's Friday. And uh, yeah, so again, thanks. And I did, I did want to say, because uh, there is that poster behind me of the Smiths, and people said they liked the new poster. I've had that poster. It was behind me in my old videos too with the yellow room, but uh, it was farther away. So anyway, it's not new, I guess, but <laughs> but there it is now because I got a smaller space behind me. But anyway, thanks again for watching, and I'll talk to you guys again soon.